Hello everybody, this is Peter, Peter the Rock. It's the last day of June, June the 30th, which I think is day number 182 of the year. So we're not halfway through the year yet, it being a leap year. And uh, the end of day 183, which will be tomorrow, Monday, would be the halfway point. I'm above a railway and I'm at uh, Chorleywood Station and serendipity rules okay again. Here comes a train and I'll wave at him and he didn't beep. Never mind. Um, now this thankfully is one of the few foot crossings come road crossings where you can actually, oops, I'm not going to risk life and limb by crossing the road with a car in it. You can actually come out over it by foot or by car or by bicycle or by giraffe, whatever your preferred mode of transport is. But I don't want to just show you that. Uh, while I'm here, I will show you uh, where the track goes. It does turn round, turn to the left here. On the other side of the bridge, it turns to the right. So Chorleywood Station is on a curve. Um, but more interestingly, perhaps, is where exactly we are. Now, Chorley, I've, many times I've walked through Chorleywood Wood, and uh, there are lots of paths around here which I'm going to explore soon. Uh, but Chorleywood Wood is kind of intermingled with Chorleywood Common. Uh, not to be confused with Chorleywood Common Wood or Chorleywood Woods Common. Uh, luckily, there's a sign up ahead of me which will give us a bit more information. And I'm rather wondering if there's, there's going to be a UR here on it. The suspense is it's quite palpable. And if I were leading a crowd of foreign students around, they'd all be excited, gabbling away. Oh, <laughs> that's right, I won't do an impression of forest, foreign students, or even forest students, because being a wood, it's kind of a mini forest. And here we have a, uh, but am I my footing here? Here we have a you are here sign. Welcome to Chorleywood Common, it says. And here's a map. Most disconcertingly, north is not um, at the top. In fact, there is no north, south, east, west sign, which confuses me. But thankfully, there's a UR here. And I think we can see this there says you are here which is in fact where I am there's the railway and there's the bridge I've just walked over so as you can see there are golf this is a good illustration really there are golf holes here here there there and they've got the hole numbers uh, up to nine I think so it's a nine hole golf course in the middle of the wood just a uh, uh, one more uh, analysis. It's a 200 acre, acre local nature reserve in the heart of Chorley Wood. So last weekend I was at uh, Rickmansworth Lakes as I call them. Other people call it the Aquadrome and uh, that was announced to be 41 hectares which at 2.5 acres a hectare is just over 100 acres. This is 200 acres, so it's twice as big. And it's a local nature reserve in the heart of Chorleywood. Commonly is comprised of a variety of habitats, including acid, neutral and calcareous grassland, heathland, broadleaf, secondary woodland, and numerous ponds. Well, they could have said just a sort of mixture of nature, really. Um, up until World War II, the common was extensively grazed by livestock belonging to the commoners. And the landscape is very different to what you see before you today. Mm. That's, that's very sort of a 
Eric, Eric Morecambe and Ernie Wise type. Uh, this is the play What I Wrote. Maybe somebody had a sense of humour. It's not signed, of course. Um, and there's lots of information there on the, the management of the, of the common and the rest of it. Um, there's, there are two ponds in sight. In fact, there are more than two ponds. There's Dew Pond, Darvell's Pond, uh, Slady's Pond and Christchurch Pond. Christchurch Pond being near the cricket ground at the north of the, uh, of the wood up there. And I've, I've filmed some cricket there. I've also filmed Christchurch itself and been round the sides of it. And that pond, which frankly is, is no, not, no great shakes, um, uh, is there. So uh, there are a few hills, there are a few features here to see. And there are little carvings as well uh, uh, in, uh, here and there. Um, the, uh, it's a Sunday, it's the last day in June, June the 30th. Um, uh, there are no signs for any missing chihuahuas. There's a sign on this post with uh, a horseshoe the right way up pointing to the right, um, which is a new one on me. I imagine that's for a horses have to turn to the right. But it's a nice place for views, this. Chorley Wood itself seems to be on several hills. It's quite a place, uh, it's not easy to walk from one from A to B at random because you're bound to be going up and down a hill. But it's a very nice place, it's outside the M25 and you can see the railway down there. So uh, given that it's a nice sunny day and I'm here, I've got a few things I want to see so I shall press on. Thanks a lot for watching so far, Feet of the Rock, Sunday the 30th of June. Cheers!